Hello, good evening. Welcome to our channel, Yushi Talks. And today we are talking about Incredible Eats on Shark Tank. We have a lot of details. Please continue to watch this video. Incredible Eats is on a mission to replace all plastic utensils with edible options. Their first product is Incredible Spoons. Dinesh Tad Pelli, a hardware engineer in Silicon Valley, was leaving the ice cream shop with his children. They all dutifully placed their plastic spoons in the trash bin, and Dinesh saw that the bin was filled with plastic. He had a vision of the oceans filling up with plastic patches of garbage as large as Texas, the whales, turtles, and marine birds dying from ingesting plastic are getting tangled up in it. What if he could make a difference by making an alternative spoon, say spoons that we can eat? He started researching the idea and learned about uh, Krugel Patel, a mechanical engineer in India who had the same idea. He was experimenting with various recipes and in the process of designing a machine to make edible cutlery. The two teamed up and after a couple of years and about 80 or so attempts, they had the recipe for incredible spoons and built a manufacturing facility. They were both with the spoons, two engineers without a clue about how to ma market them. No website, business cards, or even advertising flyers. That's when Jack Newell who's now the sales director, appeared out of blue, enthusiastic about their mission and volunteering to help with the brand with his experience in aerospace, renewable energy, and trending technologies. So let's talk a little bit about the incredible spoons. The lightly flavored spoons in table size and dessert size can be used with both hot and cold foods, including soup, yogurt, ice cream, etc. Ingredients are plant-based and non-GMOs. Flavors are, you know, vanilla, chocolate, black pepper, oregano, chili, or no flavor. Each food is individually wrapped in recyclable, re recyclable and biodegradable paper sleeves. Spoons will stay firm in cold food for 45 minutes and hot food for 25 minutes. For an extra bring a bit of crunch, place the spoons in fridge for a few minutes before using them. So let's see what happened to Incredible Eats own Shark Tank while Incredible Eats got offers from Mark Cuban and Kevin O'Leary. Their high equity demands led them to pick Lori Greeder instead, who made him an offer for 500000 for a 15% stake. So that's all we have in today's video. Please continue to watch this space for more information. Thanks for watching us. You have a wonderful day ahead. Bye-bye.